Sometimes you'll find it necessary to delete some of your existing sheets and or name boundaries to cre recreate those. So let's talk about how we do that because they are two different entities. So we've got the sheets themselves, which also includes the drawing models, and we have the name boundaries. So we'll start with the sheets. I'm going to go to my models tool um, and we'll see in this file where my plan and profile sheets are that I had three final sheets, but that was made up of three plan view drawing models and three profile view drawing models. I'm going to delete all of those, so I'm going to highlight all of six of those or nine of those and delete those. We're going to recreate our sheets with a different style of plan and profile sheet, so I do definitely want to get rid of all of those. Now in this situation, I also want to get rid of all of my boundaries, my name boundaries here, because I'm going to come back and create rectangular name boundaries instead of these that follow the curvature of the roadway. So let me turn on my profile so I see both my plans and my profiles there. The way we delete a name boundary is to go to the name boundary manager, select the group that you want to delete or an individual boundary if you were just wanting to get rid of one and replace it. We're going to select the whole group and pick delete. Now it will prompt us and says, okay, this is tied to a profile, so I'm going to go ahead and delete those profiles too. So by deleting the plan group, that's gotten both the plan and the profile. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.